It's one take Sunday. Good morning, tubes. Hey, we are June. No, we're not. It's Canada Day. Therefore, we are July the 1st, 2012. And welcome to my vlog. Alright, on early videos I had mentioned how uh, this little engine was uh, misfiring and uh, was having an issue with, uh, with performance. It was a big issue. Um, is what we found. Okay, so we're gonna get prepared to remove the air box and uh, actually expose the mass airflow sensor. And on this uh, 2000 Toyota Camry, um, it's actually right here. So you remove the back like this. And on a 2000 is also a bolt, 10 millimeter. But um, I'm seeing on this case that the plastic bracket that holds that is damaged. So you can easily just remove this this way. <clears throat> and expose the mass airflow once you remove this little clip here. Okay, the air box is open. And we'll still have a look inside, but shall we? This is inside the air box. A YouTuber had recommended that I uh, open up the air box and make a video from uh, underneath the hood um, just so he could um, he could see what or where the um, the repairs for the mass airflow sensor should be I'll let you have a look because I don't really sure where to look and what exactly is a mass airflow sensor like I said this is a 2.2 Fuel injected uh, double overhead cam four cylinder <laughs> and uh, like I said this is inside the, uh, the air box and uh, the only thing that I see connected um, we're looking at a small hole here and uh, somewhat of a sensor right there okay that's that now I had another YouTuber friend that came over last night and um, I showed him what the uh, what the vehicle was doing um, I was having like I said issues with the performance of the vehicle uh, as soon as you get onto the gas uh, from a stoplight 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 and it would just like crawl to the uh, to the traffic uh, not really getting either one gas or two fire so it was hard to uh, to find out which one is defective if not both so we started with something simple uh, we checked the wiring although when humid uh, they do leak a little bit so but it starts right up every time but it doesn't stall out so he said, well, maybe you've got uh, a bad gas because I had just put uh, $25 into the gas tank from the gas station and it's been running bad ever since. So we kind of associated the two of them together and we decided to use some of this liquid um, <laughs> gas line air freeze with the, uh, with the water remover. And uh, yes, and I did check that was one of the first things I did is to make sure that it was safe to use ideals for fuel injectors and it was so we poured that content into the gas tank uh, waited about an hour and a half or so and did a road test 
and that showed right at that time it showed uh, some great improvement uh, a lot of my mist at the bottom end uh, was gone simply uh, it still was acting a little bit there on um, on medium uh, torque or demand and um, about an hour after that um, we went out for another test drive and uh, did a little bit of city driving back there and it showed a 99% improvement just with this um, so you know I was quite impressed so I guess the verdict is that this thing swallowed some water at the gas pump um, so <laughs> I say 90% because I know that the wires are not the best and um, I can't take them out to uh, to check them because once I take them out, I'm pretty sure I will break the boot and uh, damage the coil um, once it is removed because uh, it is going down a good seven inches down into the uh, into the heads. So, yep, and it could be leaking in there also. Then again, more than likely. So, uh, YouTube. User men for cannabis. There's your shot of under the hood, and um, apparently he was a service technician for Toyota for five years. I think he said. So <laughs> maybe he can add five cents to uh, my missing puzzle for sure, and I definitely appreciate it. Again. Oh, before I forget, yeah. Happy Canada Day, people. Hope your day is fantastic. I hope, you know, you get some good weather for your, uh, for today. Um, I guess we're having fireworks tonight. Uh, so I'm not sure if I'm going there, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. So anyhow, thanks for watching. Again, Happy Canada Day. And for my friends out there in the U.S., they're blaring that the crazy crazy heat there you guys getting you guys stay cool i don't know how but stay cool and uh take care out there you too jason <laughs> peace